Hi, it's Taryn Westcombe here, co-founder of Best Body and the Pregnancy Studio, wife and mama to two beautiful girls, Sasha and Maya. Today, I'm chatting with Brigitte Kotze, one of our most recent members of the Pregnancy Studio, powered by Best Body. Brigitte has recently welcomed her little man, Marcus, into the world and has kindly joined me today to share her pregnancy journey. Welcome, Brigitte. Hello. So, <laughs> so and Marcus is there. As well. Hi. How old is he yeah. now? So he's now four weeks. Four weeks and so tiny and cute. Four weeks old. <laughs> so let's start from the very beginning. What made you get started at the pregnancy studio and how many weeks pregnant were you? So I always been active and um, I've been um, I've been horse riding all my life. So um, when I fell pregnant, I knew that I couldn't continue horse riding and I was looking for some sort of alternative or, you know, wanted to make sure that I stay fit and healthy. And a couple of my girlfriends mentioned to me about yoga. But yoga for me was a little bit, um, I, I don't know, I just wasn't wasn't too keen. And, um, and I heard about Pilates. So I thought, um, that's fantastic. That's a great idea. I think that'll that'll keep me going. So um, about best body, I actually found on Facebook. It was just randomly popped up on my um, on my news newsletters, and then I thought, oh, that sounds great. So I was pregnant um, three months because I was still working, and I decided to to give Best Body a call and see what you guys are all about and what you do and, um, and go from there. So I gave you guys a ring, um, came in for a little little chat and uh, lovely Liz did the um, I, um, introduction, which was fantastic. So I just grabbed hold of, hold of it straight away. She checked my strength and, and uh, you know, how fit I was and, and, um, and I joined pretty much, yeah, straight away. I was like, yeah, let's do it. And that's it. So um, I, I started off three times a week and mm -hmm. then, um, then the COVID started. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, so that kind, of, um, that kind of knocked me about a bit because I wasn't sure like what you guys can do or how we're going to keep going with it because the studios shut down and... And then you guys were amazing. You came up with this Zoom, Zoom thing, like like online online Pilates, which was amazing. And I kept going, and I did every. Well, I think I did pretty much every single class I tried, and that was <laughs> that was fantastic. And and I felt like throughout my pregnancy, I started to get actually fitter than I was. I thought, wow, that's just amazing. Um and all your um um all the classes i did like um it was it just it, it was just such a motivating thing for me to do every single day to um wake up i knew that i um i'm going to just keep getting stronger and fitter and and i loved it i absolutely loved it oh i'm so um, yeah yeah, no, it, it was it was great, and and it worked so well for me. So, and when you guys open up your studios again, um, that's it. I just jumped in again, just went back into studios, and then started doing my reformer Pilates four times a week. So yeah, my little man was. How many weeks were you when you did your last class? Because he came a little bit early. Uh, so. It was pretty much. It was the day before. Or the day before I went into labour, I finished. So yeah. good. Well done. Okay. That's amazing. So, yeah. and I am actually looking forward to come back in for mums and buds. Yeah. And um, I think my doctor has given me clearance. So I'm, I'm only given birth four weeks ago, but I'm feeling absolutely amazing. So I'm really looking 
<laughs> looking forward to coming back in. Get back into it. Yeah, definitely. It's one of the trickiest parts about recovery when you're so used to doing exercise like most days and then yeah. all of a sudden it's like, yeah. oh my gosh, where's my outlet gone? <laughs> it's That's definitely right. adds right. to the challenge. Now, prior to, prior to joining us at the pregnancy studio, were there any reasons why you nearly didn't join or did you have any concerns? Uh, to be honest, no, I didn't have any concerns because um, all your um, all your staff members they they made me feel so welcoming. They they literally, you know, they were they were all so warm and and so beautiful that I just I just couldn't wait to come into every single class because. Because all these intra um, instructors you guys have, they are absolutely amazing, mm -hmm. and and they really push you to the limits. Because you you know that, especially myself, like I'm really looking to challenge myself, and I always want to make sure that I get it, you know the max out of it. And they're just all absolutely fantastic. Even though you're pregnant, I thought okay, well, how far I can go. But for myself, like, oh, I always listen to my body as well. And yeah. I know that I really, you know, like to challenge myself. So the yeah. interruptions were so, so, you know, fantastic. It was just beautiful. And yeah, now I had absolutely no doubt or no questions like why I didn't really want to join my Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Now, speaking of classes, can you remember your very first class and how you felt afterwards? This might be testing you with a little bit of sleep deprivation. It was a long time ago. Well, obviously, first, when Liz um, showed me how, how to do everything and, and all that, I was like, okay, that's great. So, so I said to Liz, okay, let, Liz, let me see if I remember everything if I join my first class. So when I went in, I do remember, well, there, there was a few little, few little bits like how to use, you know, when you put your legs into the straps and how you kind of get yourself going. Because it was only my early pregnancy. So I was still, it was still quite easy for me to, you know, move around. And I wasn't like worried about any of my movements. Yeah. Um, but I remember the first class that amazed me so much how actually, how tricky and how challenging it can be, these reformer classes. And, and that's why I, I, wanted, I couldn't wait to come in for the next time because I knew that I'm going to get maximum out of it. And yeah. that's why I absolutely love it. Yeah, so good. You've actually answered my uh, next question, which is what do you love about the most? So <laughs> that's <laughs> all, always so good. And it's, it's one of these things that um, like out there a lot of people think about like our oh, pregnancy and exercise, not to challenge yourself at all. But it's not the case. As long as you're listening to your body, then there's no reason why you can't get fitter like you mentioned during pregnancy, which is absolutely amazing. That's right. That's absolutely right. Because no. one thing what I also did, I didn't just do Pilates. I also, I was running. I was running pretty much mm -hmm. every single day. Well, I can't really say I was running because I, I, I wasn't doing my personal best. But I mean, <laughs> but I was more jogging because I've been always runner. So mm -hmm. I was running up until 32 weeks. Wow. And that also, that also, you know, gave me that extra plus Pilates and and I was just yeah and that's why I guess my recovery was so quick um because I pretty much recovered within within a week well I had c-section um yeah. and then I recovered within a week I'm so ready to actually I'm so ready to give birth again to be oh. honest because I had such a beautiful birth wow. experience <laughs> <laughs> and um I am definitely, definitely looking uh, forward to coming back in and starting to do my my Pilates again, which, um, yeah. yeah, I'm dying. I'm dying to come in, to be honest. <laughs> Not far away. Now, do you think it would have yeah, been right. any, do you think your recovery would have been any different if you hadn't have done the Pilates throughout pregnancy? I think so. I think so, because... Um, I can see at the minute a couple of my other girlfriends who's given birth and they haven't really exercised or done any sort of stretches or anything. And um, 
and they say to me, Brigida, I can really see how Pilates changed your, you know, changed your recovery, changed your all throughout your pregnancy um, because you've been enjoying and you've been pain free. Yeah, I, I did mention I've been pain free all throughout my pregnancy. I had no back pain. Yeah. I had no um, pelvis pain. I had like no, yeah, no, no pain whatsoever. And my girlfriends definitely said to me, Brigida, we truly believe Pilates changed all that for you. And, and I believe that myself. Yeah, it definitely and does. Talking to other people and just hearing their experiences and their pregnancies, if they haven't really done much, um, they just kind of, yeah, been, you know, staying at home and just trying to cope with their pregnancies, you know? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Now, lastly, what would you say to someone who was considering joining the pregnancy studio? They should definitely, there's no, there's no question. They should definitely join in. There's no, um, I don't think they need to worry about anything. If they, you know, they might hurt themselves or they might just need to be careful. I don't think you really need to be careful doing pregnancy Pilates because the way how you guys made it all you know you don't hurt your belly at all you just work out all for your upper body and for your lower body so I've heard a couple of women um, throughout my pregnancy classes they they were a little bit concerned I think a few of the girls they said oh maybe we shouldn't really do this or that um, or maybe even press ups which even press ups the way how you guys made it it was very um, you know modifications whatever you made it's it was just amazing and, and it's not affecting whatsoever your pregnancy which I think a lot of women are a bit worried about it they think oh they might push themselves too hard but you really need to listen to your body and and you need to trust um, you know, trust the in, um, instructors there and, and you guys, you, you know what you're already doing, your mother, yourself and and you, you guys have been doing absolutely amazing, amazing job how you put everything together so yeah. I don't think there's anything to worry for new newcomers who really want to try pregnancy Pilates, just jump in and do it, there's, you're never ever going to regret, you're only going to be yeah, you're going to gain so much and you're going to be so happy. And, um, and yeah, that's it. Your journey is going to be completely different than if you don't, if you don't do it. Yeah. That's, that's, that's what I think. Anyway. So you felt very safe throughout. Absolutely. For me, it was, it was the safest, it was the safest exercise journey for me. And it was, it was very challenging and I absolutely <laughs> loved it. Loved it every every minute of it, every minute of it, and I definitely yeah. As I said, I keep going. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining me today, Brigida. I look forward to seeing you in class soon. Thank you so so much, Terry. Thank you so much. The best body, you guys are absolutely fantastic, and I can't wait to come in. Can't wait.